Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in this video, I'm gonna be unboxing my March um, owl crate. Uh, it feels good to actually receive a March box in the month of March uh, because all every single subscription box has been delayed lately. So it's nice to actually receive one on time. <laughs> so yeah, um, also this is really weird because it wasn't taped down. You could have literally just open it. So anyways, so yeah, that's the March box here um this month's theme was let's rewrite history for the month of march so the first item i'm seeing here is this box right here um really nice box um it says bookshop brews um glass tumbler so it's inspired by shadow hunters um so yeah let's go ahead and see the design of this we have the tumbler and a straw here. Go ahead and get it out. Okay, I love these type of um, like tumblers. They're so nice and so pretty. I love them. So there's two different quotes on it. Uh, one says a teak and you know, I don't know how that one says. Um, they're kind of hard to read to be honest, but. <laughs> So yeah, that's the tumbler. They're very nice. They're very pretty. I like the design. And then we have like the owl crate logo on the bottom, which is cool. Um, we have the straw. Um, I love these. Um, they're very, very cute. So I'm very happy with this item. Um, I love it quite a lot. All right. So the next item that we have are some socks here, which look like they're just like library socks. <laughs> So these are cute, um, hopefully they fit, but yeah, these are very, very nice. I do like them. Um, so yeah, these are very, very cute. Okay, so the next item we have is a book sleeve here, which looks very, very nice. Um, there's two different quotes on the side of this. Um, one is inspired by Kingdom of the Wicked, um, and then the other one is inspired by Deathless or something. Not really sure, but these are very nice. Though it, it, it's kind of hard to read. Um, a good book was its own brand of magic. Stories made everything possible. So that's that one. Um, then we have this one, which I'm not going to read. <laughs> but yeah, it's a nice book sleeve. It's pretty small, but it's really nice. So I do like receiving book sleeves, and I like this one. It's a nice, cute design. So the next thing we have is this, which is a pencil, which is an interesting item to receive um internal pencil which is inspired by Babel. so our Babel inspired eternal pencil is an ideal for annotating books writing tbr lists and perhaps even translating archive manuscripts at prestigious universities no sharpening requires with the innovative nib on this long lasting writing instrument with cap secure twist the bottom portion of the pencil to re reveal the eraser design um, stored inside so this a really interesting item. So we'll go ahead and take out the pencil. Um, so you have some nice little, like little roses and stuff inside the pencil here, which is really nice. And it says we're here to make magic with war words. Uh, so that's really nice. So we have the pencil nib right there, which is interesting. And then if you twist the bottom. Um, or they twist this. Yeah, it twists where the pencil is at, which is interesting. And then there's uh, an eraser inside. So I don't know how I feel about that. Like, why wouldn't I just have it like a normal pencil? But that's interesting. Um, yeah, I do like it though. It is nice. So, <laughs> yeah. So that's the Babel Spire pencil. Okay, so the next thing we have is our Treasure Tomes Anemo Pen for this month, which is inspired by Once Upon a Broken Heart. So yeah, I'm very excited for these. I love these Anemo Pens that Al Cray has been doing lately. So here we have the Ballad of Archer and the Fox. I really like the colors on this one. It's very, very pretty. And then when you open it, um, that's how it looks like, and it looks gorgeous. I love the fox, and it has the quote inside. In case you forget what the Prince of Hearts had done, and you're tempted to trust him again. That's really, really cute. I really like it quite a bit. 
this is really cute. I love these. They're very nice to receive. So yeah, and then we just have the book. Um, we have a little card promoting their app. And then we have next month's theme, which is Relics and Ruin. So that's the um, theme for April. And then each April box will include an exclusive collectible design by Ice Rolf. So yeah, that's interesting. Um, and then we have like the little newsletter that I will create does. We just have a interview with the author here. Um, and then some news from their app. Um, interview with the vendor and a Spotify playlist. So yeah, okay. So let's go ahead and finally see the book. So this month's book was Midnight, Midnight Strikes by Zeba Chazal, something like that. So, <laughs> so we have the hardback there. And this month we have Gilded Pages, which I'm very excited about. Um, Alcree has been killing it uh, because April Box is also going to have Gilded Edges. And then May Box, they're finally doing stencil edges. So I'm very excited. Um, it seems like Alcree from now on are doing special things to their pages hopefully um so i'm very excited about that um so this is the naked hardback which usually i'm not a fan of but this one is actually very very nice um i do prefer a dust jacket though but that's just me um so you have the cover there which i love this redesigned cover then we have the spine there and then the back of the book which says our fates are sealed whether we know it or not and then of course we have these gilded edges on the top and bottom and on the side of the book which i love these gilded edges they look so beautiful oh god this is beautiful this is the end pages and they have gold foiling on it which is so beautiful i love it and then they're the same on the back here but they're very beautiful and then of course we have in found in author letter and it's also signed by the author so that's really really cool i really like that so yeah i really love this book design and also really enjoyed the items for this month there's a map inside here <laughs> um so yeah i i do still prefer i still wish this did had a dust jacket um but it is a beautiful book and i'm glad they have like gilded edges um so i'm excited for the april box and the may box um, to see their books, but yeah, overall, I love this box. It's a really great box. I love the tumbler, the book sleeve is nice, the socks are nice too, and uh, even the pencil is also nice. So, overall, I'm pretty happy. Oh, and of course, um, the little normal pen is my favorite. I love these, um, and the book is beautiful. So, yeah, let me know your thoughts on the book and on the items. Um, I think they did such a great job with this month's box, so I'm really happy with that. Um, so yeah, make sure to like, comment, um, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.